Here's Delaware Governor Jack Markell's weekly message. This past weekend, citizens from across Delaware gathered to celebrate the 4th of July. Many Delaware communities recognized our nation's Independence Day with parades, picnics, barbecues, and fireworks. And I had the chance to greet many of you at celebrations up and down the state. Civic associations, school children, police, firefighters, veterans, and many more groups marched to honor the founding of these United States. Their march reminds us of our shared commitment, the continual creation of a strong and stable state and nation. With the first half of our Delaware legislative session coming to a close last Thursday, we are reminded that here in Delaware, our commitment to building a better future is as strong as it was back in 1776. Attracting jobs and putting people to work, protecting our quality of life and our public safety, developing a world-class education system, and maintaining a focus on long-term fiscal responsibility. As the dust settles after a frenetic but productive final week at Legislative Hall, we take stock and recognize the tremendous progress that has been made this year. We worked with Delawareans from up and down our great state to make progress and to make sure that our goals become reality. Our state budget invests heavily in Delaware's future, encouraging job creation, lowering taxes, and continuing to make Delaware a great place to live and do business. We work to pass an array of bills that will help create safer streets and neighborhoods, protect the most vulnerable among us, and maintain a high quality of life for all of Delaware's citizens. We moved strongly to invest in education from preschool through higher education and took important steps to ensure that education money is being spent effectively. And we've worked to create a more efficient state government that's sustainable in the long term by restricting our dependence on less reliable sources of revenue, limiting budget growth and paying off debt responsibly. The people who sat on pavements and chairs and on parade sidelines waving flags and cheering on military bands, veterans and young talents epitomize the spirit of Delaware, a spirit that has helped us accomplish so much. Coming together by working through our differences rather than emphasizing them, as we have since the very beginnings of our state, that's what we need to keep Delaware moving forward.